This video is all about one little button on the right hand side called the Windows Ink Workspace. When you click it, I think there is a combination here where we can use the sticky notes, sketchpad and screen sketch in combination with OBS recording. So to get started, first thing which is the easy one is I've opened a couple of sticky notes. One note here is that uh, the title of this video using Windows Inkspace with OBS Studio is a nice little title I've put in there and also these sticky notes respond to bold and italic control B control I. So watch this carefully. So we're in recording now and I've got a mouse and I can't annotate these or can I? So let's see what happens. If I click the Inkspace button and then I go to screen sketch what actually happens and what you're seeing on the recording is my whole screen which is kind of like shrunk down just a little bit and it's got some highlighters so now if I wanted to highlight very easily on this screen I can I can turn the ruler on and off drag that round and then show you some quick highlights if I come out of that by clicking um, say the X then you can see that everything's gone away, which is pretty easy for me if I want to show an idea. I'll show you what I mean by that. So if I go up here and I googled uh, Windows 10 Ink Workspace and I wanted to highlight this area, what I can actually do, look, is click it again and say Screen Sketch and here we are. And I can crop it in to show you, say, in a teaching session like this and say, well, actually, and there you can see it's um, put into this rectangle with everything else is shadowed out, which is quite nice because I could actually talk about that set area. You can also see that we've got the whole page um, like in dark grey and then this part here. If we wanted to also highlight, say, just um, an area, we could underneath that. And then when you click the X, everything is back to normal. So that was it really for this video. There's nothing else to say apart from the bit that I want to talk about which is the sketch pad and only to say I've noticed with the ruler and that is that it's got a lovely little uh, cross in the middle of it so if you, if you look here where you've got this circle what I've found using the wheel mouse is watch every 30 degrees there you go look um, have I got my numbers right 30 60 yeah it so if I wanted to say do a horizontal line look can you see that just as my wheel mouse is going along, the horizontal goes in bold black. Watch. And there it is. Look. And then I can go along and I can, do, say, do a, a line which is exactly, um, say, horizontal. Then if I wanted to do one at 45 degrees, I can move it along and wait for the click. So I know it's exactly 45. Yet yeah, there it is. Look. And then I can do a line which runs at exactly 45. The point of that is that if you put your mouse pointer, say, near the top, and rotate it rotates around wherever the mouse pointer is and down here look if I wanted to do it, go right in the middle then I can click here and then if I wanted to do a vertical line keep going until it goes bold it just clicks there it goes look and then I can come along say with my highlighter and mess around and do a vertical line I think in combination these things will work quite well so that was it for this video all we need to say is this was using Windows ink space with OBS studio screen recording uh, any thoughts on that brilliant i will add it to the um, playlist and i've covered screen sketch and the sketch pad ruler so in the normal way you may sub if you want to and of course see you next time